As a recruitment agencies, your target audience includes two set of peoples. Firstly, companies and recruiters who are looking for people and secondly, candidates who are looking for job openings. So your marketing strategies should be planned in such a way that you cater to both your target audience, that is employers and the candidates. Hi, my name is Jay Dattani and I am going to discuss five super effective digital marketing strategies to get more registrations of employers and candidates with your recruitment agency. Our first strategy recommendation will be have a fast and secure website. Your website is like your photo on a dating app or a site. People are going to look at it and decide whether they want to hang out with you or not. It's your agency's first impression in the digital world. So to make sure you have a good first impression, there are two things which you need to do. Firstly, have a fast website and secondly, secure your website. If your website is secure, that is, it has an SSL certificate, people are going to trust your website and it will also help you rank better on Google. And secondly, if your website loads within three seconds, there is a higher chance of people actually going through your website. And also make sure that your website is well designed, looks professional and is easy to navigate on any kind of device. And since you are catering to two different sets of people, make sure that your website conveys the correct information for each of these parties. Another strategy that's kind of very obvious for every recruitment agency is use LinkedIn. Having an optimized LinkedIn profile, connecting with HRs and recruiters, sending them short connection messages are pretty obvious activities. So what else can you do on LinkedIn? Let me tell you, you can start by running ads by targeting companies that are currently hiring. But if you may ask why target only companies and not individual candidates, well, the reason is quite simple. LinkedIn ads are quite expensive. So if you target individual candidates and acquire them, then your cost per acquisition will be very high and the return on your ad investment will be very low. Whereas if you advertise to companies and if it turns out to be a long term collab, then your ad money could be recovered within weeks or a month. One more thing that you can do on LinkedIn is create groups and encourage people to join such groups. In such LinkedIn groups, you can talk about the new job openings, also publish the dates and the upcoming job fairs and the career fairs you are organizing or even share some tips and hacks for candidates and companies. Now it might be tempting to create content around hustle culture and motivation, but LinkedIn is filled with such kind of content. So what should be your approach towards content as a recruitment agency? Let's find out in our next strategy, that is content marketing. Do you know what's the best kind of content? Content which is informative and also entertaining at the same time. And since you have two different sets of audience to cater, you can choose from the various content formats that suits you the best. You can create reels on basic topics like interview question, resume and CV building hacks, or even create some fun reels around work culture and the job challenges. And for HR managers, CEOs and CXOs, you can create testimonial videos of the companies that have hired from you and are happy with your services. And if you have enough of such testimonials, you can also create an Instagram guide out of it. Your content strategy should also include blogs on topics that HR managers, recruiters and job seekers are looking for on Google. Start by doing some keyword research, then write blogs on these topics and use SEO tips to rank higher on Google. Creating high quality content will help you get the awareness you are looking for and also more and more number of job seekers and recruiters will know about your recruitment agency. Our next strategy recommendation will be email marketing. Emails are something that everyone in the professional industry regularly use. So understand your target audience and send them email that will add some value to them and ultimately give you sales. For candidates, you can create an email drip. Basically, depending upon the stage of recruitment they are in, they will get regular updates via email. Let's say for example, if a candidate has recently registered with your services. Firstly, he can get an email of a curated job listings as per his profile. Then once he or she decides to apply for particular jobs, he or she can get an email of the interview details and other requirements. And let's say if a particular candidate has been selected for a particular job, then he or she can get the details 
about the further requirements of the job. Now, there might be even people who haven't applied for any jobs. So such email drips can also send them regular reminders for applying to new jobs. And when it comes to employers, you can send them emails of list of candidates that are suitable for the job openings in their companies. By the way, if such tips and strategies around digital marketing interest you, then do subscribe to our channel as we regularly post content around the same. Host online events for recruiters and job seekers. Colleges and institutes have been hosting career fairs and job fairs since years. But Corona has changed everything. Since everything is online, you as a recruitment agency can take such career and job fairs online and create a networking session for employers and job seekers. These events can be your lead magnets where people can register with their name, number and email ID. Recruiters can give short presentations about their companies and the current job openings and the candidates who are interested in such jobs can apply through your recruitment agency. You achieve two important things by hosting such job fairs. Firstly, employers and job seekers discover about your recruitment agency. And secondly, if some candidates get hired in such job fairs, you earn your commission as per your agreement with the companies. So it's a win-win situation for everyone. Focus on dynamic search ads. Search volume for keyword social media marketing jobs is 1,900 per month. Search volume for keyword SEO jobs is 2,900 per month. And search volume for keyword video editing jobs is 4,500 per month. This shows that even for job seekers, the search begins with Google. So it's quite obvious that you have to run Google search ads. But you can take this one step further and making your life a little simpler by using dynamic search ads. For example, if someone searches SEO jobs, then a page from your website which talks about SEO job openings will be shown to him on the top of his search result page. This will help the user with exactly what they are looking for and you will get new registrations for your recruitment agency. So running such dynamic search ad campaigns will really help you get more number of employers and job seekers registered with your agency. If you want a detailed video on how to run a dynamic search ad campaign and what are the other factors that you need to consider, do let us know in the comments below. These are some of the strategies that you can use to get more clients for your recruitment agency. But after all, it's your results and the number of people getting the job that actually matters. So try to incorporate such numbers in your marketing communication. That's it for today's video guys. If you enjoyed the video, do hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more such tips and strategies around digital marketing.